Yo, I made music once upon a time I made excuses once upon a time And even though I'm in my prime years of my lifetime I have a fear of failing, never thinking that I might shine Now we are at once upon a time slash slow Oh man, that song has such a crazy amount of emotions behind it Because it was basically about a horrific car accident that I had towards the end of 2017 and it wasn't even my intention to put that song on the album the reason why that album that song even came about was because of the accident um i was driving down seventh avenue and um you know there's the intersections where the lanes go across like that there was a guy that cut me off and bam t-boned him so Lost a car. I had an Infiniti G37 for all the car people. I am a part of a few car communities too. So that name rings a few bells. Point is, car was totaled really, really bad. I was in the hospital for a couple of hours. Minor, very, very minor injuries. But um, that's basically what that song is about. So there's two songs in one. The first song or the first half of the song is Once Upon a Time. Uh, the second half of the song is called Slow. So the first half, produced by Jordi X. Um, very, very old school production. Um, it was just me literally highlighting the accident. How I was like thankful for a second chance at life. And, um, you know, letting people know that once upon a time I had pain, I had distractions, I had reactions, subtractions, I lost things, I gained things. I had people laughing at me at some point in times with different situations I was going through, you know, so that song has a lot of pain towards it and just be me basically saying, you know, things should be simple, although we would love to have everything that way. But sometimes, you know, uh, you just got to take what life gives you, but it's not about losing or whatever. It's about how you deal with it. You're going to take wins. You're going to take losses. And slow, funny thing is there's a breakdown, there's a transition from the first half of the song, which is Once Upon a Time, second half is slow. So slow is more or less one of those like smooth bangers, like that beat is so hard. That song is produced by Jordy X2. So the first song was more sad, sentimental emotions. The second half, which is slow, was more like, all right, I'm here. I don't give a damn, like, I don't care about none of the other stuff, like, yo, like, like all you hoes gonna watch this, and all you niggas gonna watch, that's basically what it's about, I'm just kind of showboating, I'm a very laid back, humble guy, I don't like to showboat or, um, you know, gloat about things, but that song, I was like, nah, like, I almost died, but I'm still here, I'm grateful for life, and I'm gonna, you know, push as hard as I can to achieve what I wanna achieve, so, that song was more or less showing off the lyricism a bit too. Just letting everybody know that, you know, no matter what happens in pop culture, I'm gonna make my imprint. I'm gonna enter into the game once again. So that's Once Upon a Time slash Slow. I recorded that with JGF Fuego. I actually recorded that song with him and he mixed it. And mastering the game, Will Sterling. So. It's one of my favorite joints off the album too, but I more or less love the second half. A lot of people used to tell me, man, you should have made the second half of the song longer. It should have been its own song. You know, we can't always get what we want, right? <laughs> Yeah. If you never had the pressure weighing on you like a wrestler, I'm about to become a heckler, but not for guilty pleasure. And